Assalamualaikum and very good morning everyone. So today we are going to continue our lesson on problem solving of fraction and decimal. Okay everyone, let's look at this question. Let's read together. Muhi give 3 out of 8 parts of a cake to Morgan. What fraction of the cake did Morgan get? See, it said a cake. A cake means one whole cake. And then, three out of eight parts mean the whole cake is divided into eight parts. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then three out of eight is given to Morgan. So this is three out of eight. It has been taken out. So what fraction of the cake did Morgan get? So this whole cake is smoothy and then it taken out three parts. Three parts of eight part is three over eight. So Morgan get three parts of the cake. So 3 over 8 is the fraction. Next question. Let's read together. Chong eat 1 over 6 of a pizza. His brother eat 1 over 4 of the pizza who ate a larger pizza a larger pizza so here are the pizzas of Chong's brother and Chong let's see together for Chong's brother for Chong's brother it has been cut into four parts. One part, two parts, three parts, and four parts. While for Chong Pizza, this is Chong's Pizza, it has been cut into six parts. One part, two parts, three parts, four parts, five parts, six parts. Then, Chong's brother has eat one part. That is one over one over four. This is the part that has been eaten by Chong's brother. Why? Chong's pizza is here. This is the part that is 1 over 6 that has been eaten by Chong. Can you see which pizza is the larger? Which one? This one or this one? Yes, Chong's brother eat larger pizza than Chong. So, 1 over 4 is larger than 1 over 6. It can be seen also in this diagram. 1 over 6, 1 over 4. 
So 1 over 4 is larger than 1 over 6. See, it's 2. So who ate a larger pizza? Who ate a larger pizza? Yes, Chong's brother ate a larger pizza, which is 1 over 1 over 4. Okay, next question. Alia colors yellow and purple on a pattern as shown in the picture. So this is the picture. This is Alia. And this is the patterns that colored by Alia. So the question asks you to state the purple colored parts in decimal. So for this question, it asks you to state the purple colored parts and then you must answer in decimal. So there are two things you need to focus on. Firstly, we must count how many parts all together okay let's count together one two three four five six seven eight nine ten so for all together in fraction we must put below denominator and then state the purple let's count the purple one purple two purple three purple four purple five purple six purple seven purple so the part that we want is number numerator there are seven part so seven over ten is purple now the question wants you to write in decimal remember there are one Okay, so we change into decimal fraction of 7 over 10 becomes 0 0.7. There are one decimal place. One decimal place. So, purple, purple parts are 7 out of 10 parts mean 7 over 10. And when we convert into decimal, it becomes 0 0.7. The next question, let's read together. A piece of ribbon is used as shown in the table. So this is the table. Which ribbon is longer? Longer. What is longer means? So, this is short. This is long. So, this is short. This is short. This is long. Missing? Okay. Next. Let's look at this table. Length of ribbon. For Thai gift, we use 6 over 10. While for make flower, we use 0 0.4. To answer this question, remember our last lesson we learn 
using the number line. So remember, fraction and decimal is a sibling. Okay, so actually, actually, in the number line, it has a ribbon. See, this is a ribbon. Okay, a yellow ribbon. I draw a yellow ribbon. And then, this is the relationship between fraction and decimal. So, 1 over 10 is 0 0.1. 2 over 10 is 0 0.2. 3 over 10 is 0 0.3. So we want to compare which one is the longer for the ribbon to tie gift and to make flower. For tie gift, this is the ribbon for tying a gift. Okay. And then this is the ribbon to make a flower. 1 over 4 and 6 over 10. So, which one is longer? Yes, 6 over 10 is longer, which is to tie a gift. So, the ribbon to tie a gift is longer. Okay class, for this question, let's answer together. Muna eat 5 out of 8 parts of a chocolate. What fraction of the chocolate did she eat? So this is the chocolate. Now, 5 out of 8 parts. 5 out of 8 parts. The chocolate is 8 parts and Muna ate 5 out of 8 parts. Tell me what is the fraction? Okay. 1 parts, 2 parts, 3 parts, Four parts, five parts. So, did you get the answer same with me? Five over eight. Did you get the answer? Good. Number two. Kevin colored a ten part number wheel. So this is number wheel. He colored it with yellow and green alternately. So alternately yellow, green, yellow, green, yellow, green, yellow, green, yellow, and green. State the yellow parts in decimal. Remember? When we have 10 parts, it automatically we can convert into decimal. So, tell me what is the fraction for yellow parts? Done? Yes. Let's count together. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 parts of yellow, 5 parts of yellow, out of 10, so 5 over 10. So, 5 over 10 we can convert into decimal. 0 
five. Good. Did you get the same answer with me? Well done. Number three. Santi colored four parts. Zamri colored one part less than Santi. What fraction of the shape did Zamri color? Okay, look at this polygon. This polygon have one, two, three, four, five parts, and Santi colored four parts. This is Santi's polygon. While this is Zamri polygon, it has not been shown here, but it's okay. I will draw for you. Okay, so this is Alice. Okay, Santi color four parts, Zamri color one part less. One part less mean four minus one equal to three. So one part less is one, two, three. What fraction? Of the shape, the Zamri color. Now, this is Santi. This is Zamri. Tell me, what fraction of the shape for Zamri? Okay. One part, two parts, three parts out of... Three parts out of... Three parts out of five. Three parts out of five. So three over five. Did you get the answer? Zamri. Zamri. Colored three over five. Okay, class. I hope you understand this lesson. You may try to answer question in activity book. Bye. See you again.